All right, so this toilet's got a real bad lean to it. So I'm gonna go ahead and see what I can do to fix it. You girls ready? Gotta make sure you shut off the water. Go ahead and flush it so that way it drains. Make sure it's not trying to refill. Sounds good. Make sure you take the filter off your shop vac. Nice. Use the shop vac to get rid of the rest of the water. Then you just undo, holy crap, that's not a good sign, that might be part of the problem, well, then you just undo your Johnny bolts, okay, and then take your water line off, it's right there, then you should be ready to take this toilet out. Alright, so normally I'd say go ahead and lift it up over the Johnny bolts, but they fell off. Get yourself a box so when you take this off you have somewhere to sit it on because if not the wax ring under there is pretty gross. First you want to clear out some of this old insulation. It's not doing any good anyway. Alright, now you can see it a little bit better. So we're just going to cut it right around there. Right there. And then we'll put a coupling on it so we can raise it out of the floor and put the new wood down. Now we just need to cut the pipe right there. So we can lift it up out of the floor. Alright. Okay. And now. Whoa. That's crazy, man. So let's see what we're looking at under here. Exactly what I expected. Toilet hole. Now let's see if we can find out why it's messed up. From the looks of it, the wax ring dissolved and was letting water out, which was starting to pull up and damage the floor underneath it. So we'll just fix that real quick. All right, so once you cut it, just take it right out. There you go. And once we fix the floor, we'll just take a coupling and put it right over it like that. Put the old one back on it. Good to go. Okay, I got this rubber coupling from the hardware store. So that way I can put this all back together, but then since this is temporary, I can remove it later. Tighten her on up. This one. All right, so there it is. Nice and temporary. Eventually we'll take all that old floor out and fix it right. But all we gotta do is loosen that up, pull it out, and be just fine. Because there was a leak, it leaked into all the insulation, made it heavy, and made it fall down. So I'm going to fix it with a new piece of insulation. Bam. All right. <clears throat> so I really don't need all of it. Shove it in there. Yeah. <laughs> I don't need any. I don't need it in the house either. Yeah, exactly. We bought a bunch. It's almost like we knew a $700 house that had just sat empty was going to need some insulation. Yeah, you know, I'm surprised there was as much of it here as there was actually there. I know, it kind of was good. I thought the critters and stuff. Yeah, I thought there'd be none, basically. We'll take care of that. And you just kind of give a little fluff, part it on the sides a little bit, you know. Try not to breathe at all. That'll do her. Cool. Done. Done ski. It's pretty nice down here, actually. <laughs> Got my little smiley dust pan. <laughs> well, that's better than we started. I wouldn't call that perfect yet, but the floor itself is still rotten. So that is called a band aid. <laughs> A big one too. It wow. works. Uh, <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> <laughs>